this video I will talk about uh, how to become an internal auditor and what are the key qualifications that are required to become an internal auditor. So the role of internal auditor is very important within the organization and it's one of the areas where where uh, the demand in the company is being uh, on a rise. Why? Because of uh, corporate failures, because of corporate corruption, because of violation by the company in terms of rules, regulation, ethical matters. So all these uh, setbacks or all these problems lead to the need to have check and balances on those companies. And one of the key pillar to have those check and balance on the companies, they, um, and especially the management of the company, that they do their job uh, with the best interest, and uh, while keeping the interest of the entire stakeholder, including the shareholder. So, who will ascertain this thing? It will be ascertain uh, by the assurance of auditor. And there are, as I've mentioned in my previous video, there are two uh, types of auditor. One are known as external auditor or statutory auditor, and the other ones are internal auditor. So the role of internal become very important with this context. And to become an internal auditor, generally you will find the people who have uh, this is a general norm within the organization, but it is not specific. But generally, people come from big four accounting firm with an audit experience, external auditor, ex external or internal audit experience, and with a qualification like CPA and CIA, which stands for Certified Internal Auditor. And in addition to that, there are certain other qualifications like CISA, Information System Auditing. CFP certified fraud examiner and uh, CRMS certif certificate in risk management assurance. So these are some further sub specialization within an internal auditor. If someone want, wants to increase his knowledge base and skill set, so this is uh, these are the types of qualification which are being uh, typically uh, required within the industry, but Nonetheless, it's not a set pattern. You will find people with diverse background in the field of internal auditor, in the field of internal audit. Uh, for example, if someone is oil and gas, they might um, they might need to have a petrochemical engineering certificate to understand the processes and identify the weaknesses. Sometime in in a hospital setup they require someone who has a medical degree and in addition to that a CIA. Uh, I was working for a telecom company in that we had auditors from IT background and from telecom engineering background and with the finance background as well in our team. So it depends on the industry and sector but the only thing which is more important is to understand the techniques how to perform audit and how to translate your uh, your results in terms of monetary value for the stakeholder to see the impact so this is more important so this is a brief description and uh, how to become an internal auditor and what are the qualification is needed i hope with this you have now much more uh, understanding and you if you are intending to pursue this career you will have a some guideline on the on the on the way to achieve your objective thank you for watching and hope to see you in the next video